So example two is using the Murphy efficiency number and the example is ethanol and water mixture. So I'll read the problem. An ethanol water mix containing 20 mole percent ethanol is to be separated in multiple steps. Flow that is coming out of the column in the distillate is 60 mole percent ethanol and through the bottom flow 2 mole percent of ethanol is coming out. So here it's the distillate. This is the bottoms. And ethanol is most volatile component so we'll use only ethanol small fraction. So 2 mole percent in the bottom of ethanol is coming out. Uh, reflux ratio is 2. Mercury efficiency based on the vapor is 75%. So it's written as EMV. This is me this means efficiency, this means mercury, this means vapor. So the question is what is the number of equilibrium stages needed? So so let's write down the knowns. So 20 mole percent in the feed is coming in, so XF feed is 20 mole percent. We can say this is 0 0.20. XD in the distillate is 20, 60 mole percent, which is 0 0.60. XW is 0 0.02 mole percent. And reflux ratio is 2. EMV is equal to 75 percent. And it's asking us how many equilibrium stages there are and this is an ethanol and water problem so the graph looks like this sorry it looks like this so let's write down the knowns so 20 mole percent is this is XF and 0 0.02 is this is 0 0.05, this is 0 0.04, 3, 2. So 2 is somewhere here. And distillate, 0 0.2, XD. This is XW. So as we know, we draw all of this until the diagonal line over here. And X feed is. 0.2 XW is over here so let's now calculate the top operating line so TOL do you guys remember the equation top operating line equation is reflux number over reflux number plus 1 times x plus xd over r plus 1. So it, this is known and this is known. And this is our y-intercept. So now we can find our y-intercept. xd is 0 0.6, r is 2 plus 1, 0 0.6 over 3 is 0 0.2. So our y-intercept for TOL is 0 0.2. So Y intercept would be here. So T O L is gonna be connected like so. Now we need to find what is our Q line. So our Q line equation is Y equals to Q over Q minus one times X minus X F over Q minus one. So this is our Y intercept. So XF is equal to 0 0.2, Q is equal to. And do we know what is Q? So in, let's see. So sorry about that. Um, in the question, it's saying it should be saying that feed is supplied as um, saturated 
liquid. So from 100% saturated liquid we get Q over 1. So Q, since Q is equal to 1, this is going to be infinity, the y-intercept. So what that means is Q is going to be 1. So Q line would be just a vertical line. So over here, the top operating line and Q line is being intercepted. So our bottom operating line would be connecting into this intercept. So this is our operating line. Now we need to draw our stages. But remember that we have MERF ray efficiency based on vapor is 75%. So EMV is equal to 75%. So how do we draw this? We will draw it approximately. So from here, we, we say that this is 100%. 100%. Sorry, not like this like this, 100%. This is 100%. So where is our 75%? It would be somewhere, this is 50%. This would be 75%. So we can say like, this would be 50%, this would be 75%. And we do this all the way from here to here. So now we have to draw all of this like so. So this is our pseudo operating line. So now you can understand that uh, EMV 75% means vertically this is 100% and over here this is the 75% and this is the 25% so we draw these dots approximately and then draw here and this is our pseudo operating line that we need to draw our theoretical stages So our feed starts at 0 0.6. So now we have to draw our trace stages. So now we count the trays, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, so 5 equilibrium stages.